next video. Today we're going to continue our discussion of solar ovens uh, with Jim, who is an expert on these things. And Jim, is there any way people can contact you on uh, the web? Well, you, you, you can contact me and, and you can learn about more about solar cooking and, and each of these items that we're talking about through Jim at JimInDenver.com. In fact, JimInDenver.com is my website. And um, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll be more than happy to assist you there and, and find, find the ovens for you and teach you how to use each one, teach you the differences. So great, so people uh, definitely should contact Jim because Jim's an expert in these and in so many things. Just amazing how much Jim knows about everything. Now we're going to look at reflective cookers. And they work differently and there are different prices, fortunately, and they also fold down much smaller. So they have advantages. If you're in a car, well, you can't have one of those big ovens with you probably, but you might can have one of these and you might can afford one. So back to the, um, the, the issue, why would someone want one of these if they're in a car? Well, if you hold up the bag to the sun flare, it, it folds up into smaller than a shopping bag. It fits right inside here. It fits right inside there, the, everything but the pot. And we'll show you folding up at the end of the video. So, I, I mean, that, that's so small, and, and it, it, it's a perfectly fu functional solar or reflective cooker. Um, it, it's less expensive, and the same thing is true with this. It, it doesn't fold up as small, but it, it's not a large, bulky, heavy oven. It, it just, you, you can take it apart, fold it up, stick it next you know behind your bed or under your bed and, and leave it there until you need it again how much is this one that one's 158 dollars and at 158 dollars you get a three quart pot and two collapsible silicone pots uh two racks and two cookie sheets that's a lot i don't think you get any of that i don't think you get any cooking implements with this one okay the last time i looked this was a hundred dollars uh but i'll have to double check that and i might be wrong it might have changed price since then uh, and if it did, I'll put it up at the bottom. That's the difference in the price. You're gonna have to go out and buy your own stuff for this one. I, I was very generously given this one to, to work with and review, and um, so I, I, I was not party to how much it cost or what comes with it. Right, we should say that. This one was given to us for free to test. Uh, now, obviously, we're gonna try and be as fair and honest as we can, but you do need to be aware that we we didn't buy we bought you bought this one I bought that one and uh, this one was given to us to test so that that could influence us you need to know that so you've been using this one for a long time uh, oh, about a year and four months it's a long time huh. and what do you think I I think uh, it, it functions perfectly well it, it takes twice as long as it does in a in a, a sun oven. It doesn't get as hot, it doesn't retain the heat, and as you can see, it's not nearly as reflective as this one, but it's still functional. Uh, it takes two hours to do pull apart loads, uh, rolls, uh, two hours to do chicken thighs and sweet potatoes, but it, it does a great job. I've had four quarts of water in it, it takes it up to 190 degrees, which is hot enough to scald you. Right. Um, it's not boiling, but it's hot enough to make coffee, it's hot enough to do dishes. Right. Uh, you better cool it down a lot before you wash yourself you up with it. Um, so if you just put a pot of water in here, you're going to get really hot water. You're going to get very hot water. And how long would that take? It, it took hours. It took I, hours. I mean, it, it took the better part of a winter day. Um, but if you put it on in the morning, by midday you'd have warm water. Probably warm enough to be comfortable. Oh yeah, Oh, easily. 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 Um, and also in this one, they, it has a, a vinyl color cover on it and that retains, help retain some heat, help retain some moisture. You, you could actually augment it by putting a, an oven bag over your pot, which, you know, I, I, I have my, my wonderful oven bags here to wrap around pots. They add a layer of insulation. They, they add a layer of uh, moisture control. Uh, the big thing about a reflective cooker that's why we don't call it an oven is in each of these you see a black pot a black metal pot the black metal takes the sunlight and turns it into heat the ovens are lined with black metal the reflective cookers you have to put something in them to react to the sunlight 
They reflect, they uh, focus and reflect the light onto the pots. What's inside the pot gets very hot. Um, I, I, I can cook almost everything in these that I can cook in the ovens. It just takes, it does it differently. It takes, that, that t definitely takes longer than the ovens. Uh, this one can get as hot as one of the ovens. It doesn't have the ability to retain the heat uh, when a, a cloud passes. It's not as convenient uh, in that you need a bag to, to put around your pot. But they're both very functional. Right. So if you're in a car uh, and one of the, these will work for you. I mean, you can boil water. You can make bread. You can make a loaf of bread. Well, you, you can't boil water. You can heat, you water, can heat water. But you, you can make bread. You can make stews. Uh, you I made I, rice. I've made rice in them. Uh, sweet potatoes come out. Just incredible. Something about cooking a sweet potato in a, in a by solar is, is just incredible. Um, it, it, really, you, you can cook anything in these. That you, uh, anything, again, but fry and deep fry. Mm -hmm. It's just going to take longer because the ovens, which are, you know, double the price, near, are almost double the price, uh, they're, they have insulation, they're black, they have the reflectors. They're just, they're bigger and better. Uh, but these work really well. Most of us have time. Yep. We have plenty of time on our hands. So if it takes twice as long to cook, that's fine. It'll be ready by dinner. <laughs> in fact, you know, if it's ready by dinner, who cares? Right. And and in, in most instances, slow cooking is better than fast cooking. Right. Uh, no. Again, no burning. You can't burn them because it, it, you don't lose the water. Um, of course, it, and, and if you leave them in there long enough, you can overcook it, but you can't burn it. Uh, and and you come out early or, or mid morning, drop your food in. Generally, nothing cooks longer than three hours, three to four hours, and and, and it's done. And that's in all of the ovens. Um, so yeah, we we have time, and and uh, that one, it, it, the two collapsible pots make it so you could cook two smaller portions um i have got a two quart in there now i obviously you could cook uh a number of at least two of those in there and you know two quarts is a lot of food for one person yes it is yeah uh the black cookie sheets that come with that you know so you you can put a, a cookie sheet in there and, and make your cookies no brownies no brownies cookies cornbread rolls loaves of bread It'll do it. Right. So these are really good, functional, practical. They're not toys. You kind of look at them, you think, well, these are just toys, but not true at all. No, I, I use these on a regular basis. Um, I, I'd much rather use my oven or my cookers or ovens than burn my propane, than heat up the inside of my trailer when I don't want to, uh, than make a mess on my stove. Right. 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 I, I, I cleaned for 30 years. I, I hate cleaning. <laughs> you love cooking. I love cooking, but I hate cleaning up after. Uh, one thing, you one disadvantage of this is it sits like that. I should move it. Bec it, it uh, there's really not the ability to tip it up and down very well because it is cloth. It, it doesn't, I, I can't just stick a rock under the front and, and tip it up higher. This one, I can actually adjust like this and I don't have the sun finder on it but I, I can just look at the top of the pot and, and I can tell when the sun is striking the top of the pot it's, it's pretty simple this is called the all season and there's there's a good reason for it not only does it adjust like this in the winter time like the the Sal Salvador sport oven it sits on the, its back and it can start cooking at dawn. It, 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 it can accept extremely low light, which makes it very useful. Um, I, I happen to like to cook my breakfast in them. I, 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 I don't have to wait. This one, it, it's just not going to be heating up until mid morning. It, 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 it requires you, that you wait. This one, I, I just don't have to wait. Have you made breakfast in this one? Not yet. Not yet. I, I've been a little busy. No, 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 no of course. <laughs> so, in, in this, 
this one has a vinyl cover to help retain heat and moisture. This one does not. So we wrap everything in a black bag, in an oven bag, and that keeps the heat from escaping. It keeps the moisture from escaping. I, I could actually put a much a larger oven bag over that one and retain even more heat. Mm -hmm. um, that, that's the problem with reflective cookers is you're limited to black cookware. The ovens, I, I can use glass in there, I can use shiny pans, I, I can use white pans, it doesn't matter. These have to have black pans or they're just not gonna cook. Mm -hmm. But again, brownies, cakes, in, anything, it, as long as there's a black pan in there to, to take to create heat, it's going to cook and it's going to cook. This, this one actually, it was very easy when I started testing it to find out that it gets hotter than that one. Um, in fact, it gets much hotter. I, I'd say it's on par with a sun oven. I cooked some rice in it. When I went to take the bowl, the pot of rice out, the water coming off of the oven bag was dripping onto the lid. It was flash, uh, what do you, flash vaporizing. Sizzling. Just, not even sizzling, just, and, and it, it was gone. It, it gets that, it focuses the heat that well. Um, this one is, is, is just a much slower cooker, uh, functional, but slower. I, I think that's more convenient. You don't have to have a bag. You, it, it'll fold up to a smaller size. It comes with more for the money you get. This one, it's just hotter. That's, if heat is your big issue, it's, it's certainly hotter. Um, and, and plus it, it's more usable all seasons, which is its name, than that one is. Mm -hmm. One thing to tell you when you're using a solar oven or a cooker, wear sunglasses. <laughs> so let's see how much we can fold this thing up. No, it looks like it's going to be better to take off that other one. Maybe that could go under your bed. Fold that like that. It'll make that small of a. It, it could go bad. behind your couch, behind your bed, under your bed, standing along a wall. Yeah. It, it's not too bad. Um, let's fold this one up real quick. Always. Hot pads something to take to pick things up when the ovens when the thermometer says 300 degrees it means 300 degrees it doesn't just because it's a reflective cooker so there's no question that uh, this one is is smaller and easier to to take apart oh much much smaller than that although that's not terrible either It's certainly better than one of the uh, ovens. It, it certainly uses less room than one of the ovens. It, it's certainly not as fast and easy no. as this one. So again, you're, for the ability to use it in lower sun, the ability to have higher heat, there's a cost to be paid. Um, for the, the expense, the, what you get for the money, this one coming with three pots, two cookie sheets, a couple of racks, a thermometer, and, and this one just having the, what is it, a trivet and the, and the cooker itself. I, it, it's only, it's $58 less too. It's $58 less, but $58, you know, you it, it's a trade-off. You have to go out and find your pots and, right. and all of the things. So uh, again, it, it depends on what you need. Do you need the higher heat, the faster cooking? The all seasons, especially in the winter when you can tip it on its back and, and use it with the lower sun. If you really need the room, 
the convenience, the speed, uh, and, and it doesn't matter to you that it doesn't get nearly as hot. Well, I won't say nearly as hot, but it doesn't get as hot. Uh, the sun, the sun flare, it takes longer, but it takes less time to actually put it together and take it back apart. Right. Um, so if you're just stopped somewhere overnight or maybe a day and you want to, this is so easy, you'll throw it out and cook with it. Right. This, and, and for one day stop, you wouldn't probably with that. No, this, this, this would be too much hassle to, to right. screw it all together and everything else. This I, I can take out of the bag, zip it up, stick it out in the sun. It, it can be staked down uh, so that it, the wind doesn't affect it. But it, it's also pretty floppy in the wind. Right. Um, it's not really a wind it, item. No, the only solar oven I, or the solar cooker I have that is a really a wind item is the is the sport. Is the sport, and it's extremely durable in the wind. Um, then again, this I, I could augment this to make it stake down. Right. You it know, wouldn't be that hard. Um, the grommets you could put in your own grommets. Put in grommets and, and nail it to the ground or something. Uh, it's why I have more than one. Right, right. Not not just cooking for a whole group of people because each one does something different better, mm -hmm. and each one presents something that I might like. This is a this is a two quart pan. Wonderful for making rice, a small meal, uh, a three quart pan like this. And I I I, I can cook a uh, a good size beef roast, pork roast, a whole chicken. I know I can stuff a whole chicken in here, and I know when it's done because this little pop up, and that means the legs have spread. Hmm. Um, I, I can cook a, a set of ribs in that. I, I'd rather use my four quart standing pot and, and the sun oven. Um, but you can do all that in these either one of these. I, I can do that in these too. Takes longer, right? Although it may not with the All American. It may not. I, I just have take had, a little longer at least. It's going to take a little longer at it, the minimum. Um, you're you're still reliant on this pot, and, and that's a lot less black area yeah. than the two real ovens have. Right. Um, neither one of these, if it gets cloudy, is going to hold its heat very well. Right. Because there's just no, you know, not an inch of insulation holding in the heat. Right. So there there's trade-offs one way or the other. Well, Jim, thank you so much. Remind us again how people can contact you. Uh, you can find my website at jimindenver.com. You can email me at jim at jimindenver.com. Uh, I'll be happy to show you, and there's going to be instructional videos, uh, links to buy these things, um, everything you could possibly ask for, recipes, which really the recipes for these is an adjustment in time yeah. uh, and adding less water. Mm -hmm. But um, other than that, yeah, come come see me at jimindenver.com and uh, let's have some fun. Well, there you have it, folks. So even if you're in a small space, you can have a solar oven. Either one of these would be a very practical addition. Uh, a car, maybe not. In a car, it may just may not be possible. But anything much bigger, if you got a van, one of these is an option. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is pretty small. For it really room. is. I mean, you probably can find that room for that. And there's a smaller version of this oh, too. Wow. There's a there's a mini version that that I, I, I don't know exactly the dimensions, but it, it's it'd be even smaller to hold. And you know, it, I, I don't know. You could stick this behind a seat, under a seat. Sure. Mm -hmm. it, it just depends. Everybody has to, their limitations in their car. I I can't tell you what to do. I just give you all the options. Right. So there you have it, folks. One of these will probably work for you, whatever you're in. And, uh, and then you're cooking with the sun for very little money. Uh, I hope you got something out of this video. If you did, like us on YouTube, subscribe to the channel, and we'll talk to you later.